Welcome back to Let's Play Clock Tower. We're at the top of the second foyer. Let's check out some of these doors here. Hmm? Locked. Uh, I guess we'll have to find a key. Let's go in here. Large grate. Looks like a bird's nest. Let's see if there's anything in it. The pace should be picking up soon. Now that Scissor Man showed up and everything. Uh, that took out some of my stamina. Oh, I got enough. What is this? This is full of eggs and junk. What, nothing in it? Ah, screw you. Okay, I'm over here. Stop. What's in here? And again with the bugginess. Oh well, I'll just bear with it. Moving dot dot dot. <laughs> oh boy. No good. Too high to climb up. Why is it doing that? Is it my emulator? Is it my reversion of C Super NES? It's never done that before. Oh well. Okay. Now let's see if we can get over there. What's in the box? There are some clothes here. What kind of clothes are these? Picked up a black robe. Oh, that's not ominous at all. What's this? Some rope. Oh, goody. Nothing else here. A can of insecticide. That's going to be useful. Okay. Keep going, Jennifer. I like how there's almost no music in this game. I have a saying when it comes to my horror games, and it's that silence is the scariest sound. It was played to magnificent effect in the Resident Evil remake that came out on the GameCube in um, 2002. I think it was 2002. Was it 2003? Regardless. Let's go downstairs. And it works occasionally well in Silent Hill. Although sometimes Silent Hill likes to go totally opposite of this. Such as in Silent Hill Zero. Where you go into the other world inside the hospital and it's playing music that sounds like rusty steel bars being grated against each other in a metal concert or something. It was unnerving to be sure, but God, it was more of a headache than anything. Hey, look, a door. It seems that the door is locked. Let's go this way. What's in here? An iron frying pan. 
You could, you know, grab it so you could hit Scissor Man for it with it. And again, I'm saying this to a 15 year old girl, so whatever. Let's go open up the fridge. A ham was put here. Okay, I'm gonna need this for later. Some drinks are lined up here. See what's in the giant. Let's see what's in the ice box. Something shiny here. Ugh! Bugs. Lots of bugs, do you? Uh, get away. Let me open my inventory. How do I use this? You know what? Leave. Get out of here. Ah, well, that was horrific failure. And I gotta wait for my health to regenerate. Oh boy. You know, I'll do that off camera. Let's keep exploring for now. Oh, what's in here? The keys aren't here. I love how she just gets in there. She must say something like it's a car. I can escape. But doing so will give us a bad end, so let's get out of here. Run, Jennifer, run. Let's go back upstairs to the second foyer. And give me that phone. Hmm. There's Jennifer. I really need to find a place to rest. Oh boy. West Wing key. It's a swimming pool. There's a courtyard outside. It's a swimming pool. <laughs> That's goofy. And um, we're just about out of time again. Let's see if I can get in here. Okay, we're in the West Wing Hall now. 
Um, stay tuned for more Let's Play Clock Tower. We're gonna see if we can figure out the secrets of this crazy place. Stay tuned.